Learn how to manage your Festo devices in MyFesto. Start in the MyFesto area where you can find the menu point devices. When you click on this, the device management opens and you have a device list where you can maintain a list of the devices that we physically own. To add another device into this list, you can click register device and enter a valid product key, after which you can see a preview for the device. Click on register device puts the device into the list. When you click on the product key here, the device details page is being opened. In the top region you can see the device setup with a couple of basic device information and a selection of links. One that leads to the spare parts catalog of Festo. One that leads to the Festo online shop catalog page of this product and one that direct links to the download section where you can find manuals and other files for download. In the section below, headed security advisories, you can see information about reported vulnerabilities that could affect this device. Each entry is assigned a criticality value and color coded depending on the severity. If you open this one up, you can see a brief description of the vulnerability. Here you can also find the publication date of the security vulnerability, the version, a link to the report on the VDE Association's website and some files to download with further information. In the last section for the device details page, you can see the software licenses which are currently assigned to this device. This device is a Vita Motion Terminal with a couple of assigned Motion Terminal apps. Here you can also download the license file for this device, or go to the Festo App World, where you can purchase additional software licenses.